check one two one two. We live, baby. Come, come, come on. <laughs> That's right. Okay. Can you can you can you hear me now? Oh, let's go. <laughs> it's your boy Big Chew, the voice of the beat. You know what I want? Blaze up! Come on, Blaze up! It's a beat for me. Wah 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 wah
It's ridiculous at this point. You know what I'm saying? Maz, if you could find my link over there on my wall, Dago. Opinionated got it. Let me let me pin it. I'm gonna pin this. Pin. Nope, wrong one. Sorry. Is this the right one? Nope. How I keep on oh, my fingers too fat now. There you go. That's the rumble link. Okay. So say hey, Saint. Say hi to everybody. Hello, hello, hello. This is not about you. Okay. So are you done? Okay. Thank you. Thank you, P. Love you. Yes. So back to me. Because that's what this is all about. Shout out to everybody who pulled up to the birthday bash. We are going to joke about a few topics. I don't want to hold you guys too much longer. Hold on. Really, really quickly. Before I do that. Y'all have been blessing me on Cash App. Do you hear me? Y'all have been blessing me on Cash App. So let's start. Let's start here first. Thank you, uh, Nessa or Ness0214 for the Cash App. I appreciate you. She says happy birthday. Thank you, Shishi, for the happy birthday Cash App. Y'all have been blessing me. Y'all have been blessing me. Y'all have been blessing me. Thank you, Radiant to you for the Cash App. Happy Cake Day, Pisces and Sister. I appreciate you, my love. Thank you, uh, Makila, for the cash app. She says, happy birthday. Y'all have been blessing me today, and I appreciate y'all. I, I would really appreciate y'all to like the video, too. Thank you, Ash Jocelyn. She says, happiest birthday. Thank you so much for the cash app. Who else we got up in here? Um, Mignon, thank you five shot, for shot o'clock at the door. Happy solar return, bitch. Oh, yeah, solar did return. It did. It returned today. Mm -hmm. Today was the day. Today was the day. You know, it makes me get into the, you know, it doesn't make much sense. There ought to be a law against. It make me want to just be, you know, turn into, um, what's the man name? The blind man. Why does it look like this? It's just me. I'm tripping. I need to leave it alone. I'm, I'm doing the most. But, um. It makes me want to turn into Stevie Wonder. Thank you, uh, MDY58 for the cash app. She says, happy birthday. I appreciate you most. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Who else on here? Thank you, um, Ness. I think I, I, I said that. But anyway, thank you again. I appreciate you. Thank you, Honey Bunny P, for the cash app. Happy birthday, beautiful. <laughs> Y'all about to make me get the crochet face. Thank you, Whitney Pooh, for the cash out. Thank you, Quila Only, for the cash out. Lady Libra, thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. It's a, it's a host of y'all, Kiki. Thank you, thank you, thank you, Lone Star Angel. All of y'all, thank y'all. Girl, it's hot. Why is it so hot? It's this wig, girl. You know, I ain't gonna be out of, I ain't gonna be up in this too long. I'm trying to be cute, and I ain't thinking practically, girl. All right, let's get into some things. First of all, if you haven't already, please like the video. The link to the Rumble is pinned to the top. If you guys would do me a quick favor, if you want to come on, I just want y'all to follow me over there anyway, even if you don't come to the after party. But I would really appreciate it if you guys um go and follow me over there at that link at, on Rumble because we're going to do an after party over there. We're going to have drinks. We're going to have... Uh, um, I need the leadership alone. We, 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 we're going to have drinks. We're going to have everything. So please follow me over there. I hope you guys see my background. I did put up a background. Look. I remember somebody saying, Voodoo, where's that sign your baby bought? You ain't never have it up there. Now, remember, before I was uh, I was broadcasting from a place that had a lot of uh, like space behind me. And um, what happened was it was messing with the sound. So I realized I need to be where my voice can bounce off of a wall. So I hadn't had it up. It, the, it's pinned to the link, you guys. If anybody need the Rumble link, it's pinned to the link, okay? And then I realized I was just like, mm, girl, like, you could just put it up behind you. And so I did. Look, I went to Party City. I got me this and, and uh, the little bag drop and some balloons. Well, I got the balloons from uh, Walmart. So, yes, I do have a background for you guys. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you, D-Truth. 
Thank you. She said, I've only mentioned it five times. I'm sorry, baby. I didn't see it. Mm-mm. Mm-mm. So if, before we get started, I feel like I, I would just ask you guys one favor. If you guys can, can you please drop some purple hearts in the chat for me? Because it's my birthday. I just feel like, you know what I'm saying? Like, a happy birthday is a happy birthday. I just hope that you guys could, you know, what do the woo the way wham. So can you please, if I if if you can, drop some purple hearts for the doll. Happy birthday to me. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. Thank you, my eye. Oh, y'all still sending. Jenny, Valencia, Leslie, Deborah, Pam, Candace. Y'all still sending Lakeisha, Ivory, Sonia. Thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. All right. Um, oh, thank you. <laughs> let's get into this content, girl. This is the time. All right. So let's start off with um, thank you, Anita. Happy birthday. Thank you so much. I I, I, pre I really appreciate y'all. Let's get into, let's start off with um, let's go get Kanye. So Kanye is beefing with Drake. And it must have been a silent beef because Drake didn't know. You know what I'm saying? Y'all know what a silent beef is? Have y'all ever heard of a silent beef? A silent beef is basically this. You beefing with somebody or somebody beefing with you and you ain't even know. So what it seems as if is Drake had a silent beef with, no, not Drake, I'm sorry. Kanye had a silent beef with Drake and uh, it seems unbeknownst to Drake. He didn't have no idea. He didn't know what was going on. So let's go get it. Let's go get it. Let's go get it. So Kanye in the middle of the night, you know how Kanye do. Y'all already know what it is. Y'all already know how I go, what, what, what Kanye does. Kanye wakes up and chose violence. That's what he did. And when he woke up and chose the violence, he said what he had to say. And what he had to say was some bull or whatever. At least according to uh, Drizzy, Drake. If that's what y'all want to call him. So let's go get what he had said. So yay, Yeezy, whatever y'all would like to call him. He got on here and he wanted to say what he had to say. So let me go get it. First of all, he, let me tell y'all something. Kanye West is somewhat of, no, I ain't gonna call him a genius, but he's very smart. Look at yay. Yay has literally monetized listening parties. Look, you can't make this shit up. Ye will make an album and then sell out an arena for y'all to sit down there and listen to it. Look, enough to, for people to catch a seizure. Look at this. I hope nobody sees throughout this concert while he over there sacrificing the whole audience, allegedly. Maybe. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. He has monetized a listening party. You know, before... You used to just go to a listening party. It wasn't, you know what I'm saying? But now he's killing two birds with one stone. He makes money and he gets to steal your soul, allegedly. Shout out to Ye. They keep going down there. The nigga in all black with all white backgrounds. They got lights flashing. They got people can't see what's going on. You know what I'm saying? Um, And yeah, that's just what it is. But shout out to Ye. Ye have his time and his days. You know, when he be right on some stuff. Uh, but ultimately, as a as a whole, yeah, crazy is a best of us. You know what I'm saying? Look at him. But he ain't that crazy. Look. Now, him and Future down now. Mm-hmm. While he's over there grabbing souls. One at a time. One verse at a time. Look at him. Look. He, he inviting them in, allegedly. Mm-hmm. Shout out to Yeezy. You know what I'm saying? Shout out. To Yeezy, you know what I'm saying? But let's go get it, what he had to say about Drake, because, you know, a lot of people was in their feelings. Well, not really in their feelings, but a lot of people was like, what the hell? See, Drake woke up and was like, dang, what I did? Like, how the fuck did this come back on me? But apparently, like I said, it's a silent beef. When you have a silent beef, you don't know that there's an issue. The other person know, but you don't know. You guys like the video, please. The other person knows, but you don't know because, you know what I mean? Let me see. This is just it. No, not that one. Hold on.
Oh, yeah. Hold on one second, you guys. I'm sorry. This was another day of unpreparedness. I apologize. Um, let me see. Drake. Kanye. I say, now, what is Kanye over there talking about? Here you go. This is what he said. This is what he said. Now, Drake shared it and was like, what the hell is happening? This is what happened. Peep this. Now, this is what Ye woke up on Instagram, I guess, and said. And it seems as if that's what it was. He, he said this on Instagram. So, Drake says, no, I'm sorry, not Drake. Ye. Ye says, Rich Ty Cardi and the supporters that stood by us through everything. This number one is for you. It's for the people who won't be manipulated by the system and fuck Adidas and everybody who works there or with them. I thought he started working back with them. I thought he started working back with them. Anyways, he says, anyone who goes to school with anyone whose parents work at Adidas. God damn. The chair too? Just know they tried to destroy me. And here we are with the number one song in the world. Like that fake dude I saw in the lobby at the Ritz that works at GOAT. You P-U-S-S-Ys don't stand for shit. And F everybody at the Daily Mail. Dang, they caught a stray. Why the Daily Mail caught a stray? Now I see why. Now I see what um what Shay, Uncle Shay Shay was talking about. How he catch a stray? How the Daily Mail catch a stray? And F everybody at the fashion houses that side with Gabby and Haley Bieber. Haley Bieber? Is that Justin Bieber wife? F each and every single one of y'all. And F Christian that watched me have my kids taken out of my control. That's how I feel. And it's F Drake, oh God, for talking, for, for taking dirt right at the beginning of the vultures and roll out. I'll come back to y'all if I think of more FUs. So basically Drake came out, not Drake, Ye came out to say F Adidas. If your churn go to school with uh, other churn and they mama work there, F them too. He said F uh, the people at the lobby in the Ritz. He said, uh, the people that work at GOAT, he said, F the Daily Mail, F the Fashion Houses, Haley Bieber, I don't know what she did. He said, every single one of them, he said, and every Christian that watched him have his kids taken. So if you are a Christian, uh, Ye said F you. That's what Ye said. Don't come telling me nothing. I'm just telling y'all what Ye said. So if you are a Christian woman and a good woman, a good, good woman, Ye said F you. Okay. And then he also said F Drake, but, uh, you know, for the end, saying for having, uh, for taking Dirk right out at the beginning of the Vultures tour and roll out, I'll come back and he'll let y'all know if he got more FUs, you know what I'm saying, for y'all. So, you know, yay is yaying, you know what I'm saying? That's just what it is. Yay is yaying. That's what yay does. He yays. Now, I don't know what sparks these, you know, just wake up one morning and say, fuck it, you know what I'm saying? But whatever sparks it, it works because yay is yan. And that's just what it is. You know what I'm saying? So, yes, if you are any one of these people on the list, any one of these people, yay say it F you. Okay? Thank you guys for the happy birthday. Thank you guys for the happy birthday. Now, this was Drake's response. Fuck T.I., fuck Nelly, fuck 50. I'm like, what do you say fuck me for? Fuck T.I., fuck Nelly, fuck 50. I'm like, what do you say fuck me for? Fuck T.I., fuck Nelly, fuck 50. I'm like, what do you say fuck me for? Mm -hmm. Fuck T.I., fuck Nelly, fuck mm -hmm. And you know, this was a very appropriate response because just like Drake, we are all confused. What happened? Thank you, Dion. What happened? We are all, we, Drake, you and everybody else is in confusion. I'm pretty sure the other people on this list, including the Christians, Y'all don't know why Ye say F y'all neither. And I know y'all don't because we don't. If Drake don't know why he say F them, then the Christians, I know y'all don't know. Y'all have no idea. And that's that's typical Ye. Ye is yang. You know what I'm saying? But ultimately, you know what I'm saying? Um, 50 is over there like, what the hell? How did I get into it? Let me run it back one more time. One more time. Hey, what do you say fuck me for? Fuck T.I., fuck Nelly, fuck 50. I'm like, what do you say fuck me for? Mm -hmm. Fuck T.I., fuck Nelly, fuck 50. I'm like, what do you say fuck me for? Now, this is Champagne Poppy. Now, allegedly, he's over there dating Lotto's little cousin. 
Now, while y'all was over there dragging um Drea, and we about to get on her next, for uh, messing with somebody's son, you know what I'm saying? Y'all got to go give the same energy to that high yellow nigga, Drake, because he's over there messing with somebody's daughter, okay? And I don't want to hear it's different, because it's not different, allegedly. But yeah, um, shout out to Champagne Poppy trying to figure out what the hell going on because he's just as lost as us, and I'm just as lost as him. And if you're a Christian, I'm pretty sure you lost. But they said, I didn't say it, they said that y'all supposed to love everybody. So even though Ye said F you, you have to, you know what I'm saying? You you still have to love him. You still have to love him, okay? So we don't want to hear that ugly ass shit. Now, Ye said what he had to say. Moving on. So now let's go get Drea. So Drea has been seeing the news of everybody dragging her, all the men's, all the schmins that play, that dribble balls and throw them and catch them, if you know what I mean. Mm -hmm. All the schmins that dribble, throw, catch, and play with balls, um, they all had something to say about Drea. You know, and Drea has been noticing what's been going on. And Drea said, not on my watch. Not on my watch. Allegedly, that's what Drea said. Drea said, what we're not going to do is this. And because we're not going to do this, um, what we're going to do is just, you know, we're going to turn it up a notch. That's what we're going to do. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? So Drea went on to post that she is in her third trimester. And not only is she in her third trimester, fuck a bitch, a whole a nigga bitch or a bitch nigga. You feel what I'm saying? Who got something to say about it? Now, we all know Dre around there uh, trapping these people. We know this. This is not nothing new. This ain't, this ain't, you know what I mean? Like, we, we this didn't surprise us like the silent beef Ye had with everybody, all the Christians and all of that. We all knew, you know, but Drea said what she said. Let's go get her. So, Drea... Goes online. Let me go get it. Hold on. Sorry, guys. Y'all hear them hyenas? Girl, Jesus Christ. Before we get to Drea, I just want to say this part. Shout out to the Barty gang. If you're on here in your Barty gang, if you on here and you Barty gang, 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 however she be saying it. Matter of fact, if you're from New York, get up here. I'm, 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 I'm tired. I'm tired. New York, I need the green lady in the chat. Put the green lady in the chat. Don't tell me you're from Jersey. Don't tell me you're from. A, put the green lady in the chat because I'm tired. I'm tired. I'm, I'm tired of y'all. New York, I'm tired. I need New York up here, please and thank you. I need the green lady in the chat. I need the green lady in the chat. Mm hmm. Yep. Yep. You know, if it can happen to Cardi, you niggas don't stand a chance. Do you understand me? Yes, daughter, the most high New York stay in trouble, as they should. I don't want to hear, but I'm from Jersey. We don't care. You're from New York, where we at? Everybody that ain't from New York, New York and New Jersey is the same thing, okay? Now, the green lady is in the chat, the lady with the thing in her hand who keep the light on like the Motel 6. Let me just say, New York, y'all have taken massive L's in the past few weeks. Including but not limited to Cardi, Barty, Barty gang, 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 out here looking like Krishan on the side too. Okay. So if anybody ever questions what city is at the top of the what the fuck list, you have not been uh uh to the dollhouse. Cause see, at the dollhouse, we all know what city it is. It's New York. Concrete jungle where dreams are made. There's nothing they don't do. Talking about New York. These niggas think they be brand new. Side tooth falling out too. Let's hear it for New York, New York, New York. New York, Um, I stumbled upon this. Again, I don't go look for this. I, I swear to God, I don't be on here saying, let me go see what's going on with New York. New York comes to me. And this is why I know that there's a kindred spirit there. You know what I'm saying? 
uh, uh, um, and, and, and it, it draws me to you. Um, so yeah, New York, y'all taking a massive L. If Cardi could get her, her veneers and one of them bitches fall out and it give Krishan rockhead, then you have no, you stand no chance. So I hope whoever got on here, if you got, if you got the veneers and you think you good forever, the lie detector test determined and New York determined that was a lie. That girl said she was eating a bagel and they came out, girl. What kind of bagel was that? Mm -mm -mm. New York, y'all gotta be stronger than this. New York and New Jersey, all y'all the same. I don't want to hear that ugly ass shit. Y'all gotta be strong, okay? New Jersey is New York. Every island is Jamaica. Every other nigga come from Africa. Nigeria to be exact. I don't want to hear. Oh, he from Kenya, Nigeria. Oh, she from she from New. I don't care. New York. Oh, they from Trinidad, Jamaica, girl. What is you talking about? Well, I'm not, we, listen, we don't have time to be learning all that ugly ass shit. There's three main places for the Negroes. Do you hear me? It's New York. That includes New Jersey, all upstate and downstate. Then we have uh, 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 Jamaica includes any island outside of America. Not the, ter the territory is included. That's all. They all is Jamaica. And then any other Negro on the planet that don't come from either New York or the, or the, or the, or the, um, or the island, he from Nigeria. I don't care. I'm not learning all of that. I don't have time for that ugly ass shit. It's New York. Okay. Nigeria and Jamaica. That's it. The fuck? We ain't got time for all that. This is broad Brunswick. This is, this is Newark. This is, this is no voodoo. This is from the boogie down Bronx. We don't care. It's all the same, New York. Y'all all the same. Say what I see. All right, let's move on. I just wanted to show y'all uh, Krishan's twin in more ways than one. Like I said, if you're on here and you're Barty gang, don't come dragging me. I didn't do it. The bagel did it. Go drag the bagel. Moving on. So now, where were we going? Oh, we was going to get, um, because see, we got to get Masika too. But before we go get Masika, who was we talking about, girl? Who are we talking about? I said, who we who are we talking about first? We talked about Ye and then Drake. And then I said, who, let me go see, girl. Who else was we talking about? We were talking about somebody else. Drea, Drea, Drea. Thank y'all. See, that's why I love y'all. That's why I love y'all. Thank y'all. We was going to get Drea, girl. Let's go get Drea. So yeah, Drea came on here to tell us, tell us we don't, she don't give a fuck. And she did trap him. What's up? That's how, that's what I got from it. She done got, the, she done made the little boy go get tattoos. Oh yes. He got a tattoo. Yes, he did. Mm-hmm. That's, that's the big F you into y'all. Cause see what y'all not going to do. And uh, according to Drake, Drea, I'm sorry. What y'all not gonna do is have um Drea over here looking like she's a villain. So Drea went say, hey, "Come here, little nigga. Go get my name tattooed on you." And he said, "Yes, ma'am." And he went got it tatted. What's up? What's up? I'm trying to see something. I'm trying to see something. Now that's for all the haters, all the schmins dribbling balls. She said, "Eat that, nigga. Let's go get it. Here, you go." Now, this is Drea, her man, her man, her man, her man, and he has a tattoo. Now, I can't hardly see it. Oh, Lord, my balloons fell. I get them. I can't hardly see it because, you know, sometimes with Negroes, if the ink ain't real dark, you're not going to really see it. But ultimately, he got the name tattoo. What's up? Thank you, Toto. Dre says, stop playing with her. That's what I get from it. Stop playing with me. Because next time I'm going to make him put my face on his face like Krishan Rock. Like Rockhead. Stop playing with me. Y'all leave Dre and her little boy alone. Leave Dre and her stepson alone, please. Okay? Dre says she's tired of playing with y'all. Okay? So I think at this point, let Dre rob the cradle in peace. Let her rob the cradle and priest. We, we don't want this young man to have to make real drastic mistakes like Rockhead did and go get a, a whole face on his face. Let's stop at the tattoo. Leave Drea alone, okay? She done adopted this child. That's her. She could do whatever she want with the child. She's adopted him, okay? 
leave Dre alone. Now, because we this is a tattoo right here. The next thing I'm telling you is going to be something crazy. And then y'all going to be sitting up there wanting to call the police. Then y'all going to want to call Child Protective Services. And y'all going to be wrong for that. You don't get to call Child Protective Services. That girl ain't, you know what I'm saying? You, I'm just saying. I'm just saying. Because next step, y'all going to be wanting to call CPS. Don't do that. Leave that girl alone. Leave that girl alone. Shoot. Look at YouTube hating. Kick me out the chat. YouTube, how you gonna kick me out of my own chat? That's crazy, ain't it? Okay. Thank you, Diana. Thank you to everybody sending me a um happy birthday. Happy birthday. Thank you, thank you, thank you. All right. Is this on right? This thing on. All right. Um, let's move on. Now let's go get Masika. Oh, yes. Now, Masika, so just hilarious. No, I ain't gonna call it hilarious. Because the T.S. called her hilarious. Allegedly, apparently, Jess Hilarious has something to say about um, Masika. Now, first and foremost, Jess, I know you quick with it. I know you one of the girls when it comes to that type of stuff. But Jess, I'm going to tell you not, fat. That was the wrong tree to balk up. What Jay-Z said, do not balk up that tree. That tree will fall on you. That bitch will not only fall on you, it won't make a sound so nobody will hear it in the rainforest. Thank you, lucky girl. So Jess goes on, Jess with the mess, and my news is real. You know what I'm saying? And she's on there telling everybody, oh, Masika's alleged baby father. You know, that's, that, that's how they say it up north. Baby father uh, with the one eye. She up there hollering, bop, 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 one eye. You know, and Masika didn't too particularly like that. Masika said, bitch, who you think you playing with? So let's go get Masika. Now, we all know, like I said, Jess is quick with it. You know, she's one who could come back with the comebacks. But Jess is not in a tongue wrestle. Jess, you can't hold a candle to Masika. Masika, one of them girls. Masika is one of them girls, okay? So let's go see what Masika had to say. Because Masika said, bitch, go find you something to play with. You. Play with your... Don't play with me. You know what I'm saying? And then we're gonna get in, we're gonna get into how the TS inserted him their self into the mess and wonder why they turn around and play victim. See, we on to it now, but let's go get it. Hold on. Let's go get it. Now, this is Masika. Girl, 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 girl. I don't give a f if she's pregnant. Allegedly. Allegedly pregnant allegedly pregnant by her al alleged boyfriend mm -hmm. who no one allegedly knows who the fuck he is but i'm gonna get to that i'm gonna get to that i'm gonna play where she what she had the audacity to say i ain't about to hush about a thing. run till that mm -hmm. i don't give a fuck what the fuck she is she need to shut her goddamn mouth. Oh, I'm with you. actually had a baby, so people was calling her out. Okay. Only slaughter reveals reason for ending pregnancy. Well, uh, let, me, let me start this from Hip Hop Show. Tell us. Only slaughter reveals reason for ending pregnancy. Uh, Monique <clears throat> is from Love and Hip Hop. She's also a little fierce baby mother for people who don't know. So after Monique went on for a good amount of time, um, Masika, who's also from Love and Hip Hop, <clears throat> who is uh, allegedly, what, what's that guy name with the one eye? Fetty Wap. Yeah, Fetty Wap, baby mother who allegedly who allegedly has a child by who the with that one eye nah. first of all I have an almost 8 year old child for you to sit here and talk about some I allegedly have a child with her father allegedly my child is almost 8 years old mm -hmm. everybody knows who my child's father is including you and then you want to act like you don't know who the fuck he is who that rap with that one eye but that's funny because when I just scroll back through all of our text messages starting 2016, 17, 18, 19, was texting me asking who the fuck was the brown that my baby daddy was with and who this and who that. And I was fucking some of them girl. I don't give a You know exactly who the fuck he is. So first of all, put some respect in his name from jail or not. Don't play. First of all, don't play with me. Don't play with my child. Don't do that. M Masika, who allegedly has a child with the rapper, the one girl, girl, aren't you allegedly pregnant by fucking Puerto Rican nigga that's prettier than you, bitch? Get that don't nobody know what the fuck, who the fuck he is, or what the fuck he does. Is he a professional boyfriend? Don't fucking play with me. Don't fucking play with me because I've always been nice to you. 
just with the mess. Girl, girl, girl. Did girl. you catch that? Did y'all catch that in? She said, aren't you allegedly pregnant with a Puerto Rican nigga that don't nobody know who's prettier than you? Oh, my God. Let me tell you something. If a bitch told me my nigga prettier than me, there's only two, there's only two, two ends of this spectrum. Either you ugly than the motherfucker or he, that's just it. You just ugly than the mother. Like, what? You know, no shade, no tea. Jess is one of them super cent type of bitches. They go get them nothing ass niggas off the corner, dust them off, give them money, make them look like they got it. And then they come back to us and say, look at my man, my man, my man. He got money after they put him on. It's not just her. What's the other one? The little slim, ugly one who just had the baby. I shouldn't have said ugly. Fuck it. It's my birthday. I can say what I want. Oh, 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 oh. You know, the one who just had the baby. Oh, who be who used to hang with them? Girl, y'all know the girl name. It's going to come up in the chat. They all go do that. Not Jennifer, her ugly ass too. Not Jennifer. Uh, uh, um, girl, skinny. She used to do them skits on Instagram and all of that. Y'all know who I'm talking about. Crusty Red, her too, not her. Lala, that's her name. Lala, Lala, whatever the Mignon or Lala Milan. Yeah, Lala. That's what they do. It's a whole group of them bitches. I'm, I'm gonna give you the group. I'm, I'm gonna put. I'm gonna give you the group. Now, the group captain to me will be Supercent. The only reason I'm saying Supercent is the group captain is because Supercent has had multiple of these niggas and put them in front of our face. So we're going to give Supercent the group captain, okay? Then we got after Supercent, we got Lala Milan. We got uh, 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 Jess Hilarious. We got, oh, you know, it's a bunch of these hoes. You know, they just go get the worst, the most nothing ass niggas, dust them off. Put a little clothes on them, the one two piece on them, and then they put them up in front of us and make us think that he, you know, Jennifer Williams, she another one, and make us think that he's, you know, this, that, and a third. But see, when Mad Day come, then it's what car you gonna drive, Lewis? What ID you gonna use, Lewis? We don't wanna hear that ugly ass shit. We don't wanna hear it. We don't wanna hear it. Cause when you was lying, having that nigga give you your money and acting like he was giving you a birthday present, but it was your money. That he was giving to you and you were saying, Hazel E, another one. Sexy Red, another one. That's what they do. You Then, then when Mad Day come, it's who ID you going to lose? No, bitch. No. Keep that energy, ho. You stand down. Stand down. Just break up in peace. Leave your nigga in peace. Jennifer Williams. I'm talking about from basketball wise. That's the Jennifer I'm talking about. Leave your nigga in peace. We don't want to hear it. We don't want to hear it. But for that girl to say, a Puerto Rican nigga that nobody know who's prettier than you. Oh, my God. I ain't going to lie, y'all. We'd have had to fight. Because, bitch, what is you trying to say? What, what, what is you trying to say, bitch? We got to fight now. What, 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 what you saying? What is you saying? Oh, right, London? Girl, I am swinging. Listen to me. Listen to me. If a bitch tell me my nigga prettier than me, I have to fight. I don't, you know what I mean? I know I'm grown. I shouldn't be thinking like that, but fuck that, bitch. You. I'm with you, London. I'm swinging on my soul. On schoolyard. Do you hear me? I'm swinging on schoolyard. Do you hear me? This is what's happening. We're not, like, there's nothing else to talk about. On schoolyard. Win, lose, or draw. We, I'm still swinging. I don't give a f- about none of that. Oh, yes. Yes, 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 schoolyard. Sharon said, not schoolyard. Yes, schoolyard. I got to. What are you talking about? I have to. There's nothing else to say. After that, bitch, you trying to play in my face now. Come on now. But just with the mess, you're wrong. Now, 
most of y'all are saying, well, what T.S. Madison had to do with it? I'm glad you asked. Well, the T.S. who wants to run around acting like uh, they are for black women, even though as soon as it comes down to this said T.S. to have an issue with, uh, 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 with or anybody to have an issue with one of the T.S.'s, this person clearly, without a doubt, picks a side. Mm-hmm. Like, there's no doubt about it. She picks a side. This person decides to insert themselves in it. You know, and then and, and, and this is where the victim call comes in. Because, see, then when, when Jess goes back on the radio show, because even though I don't like Jess, if Jess go back on the radio show tomorrow, the show tomorrow, and call her a big bike bison bitch-ass nigga, then it's going to be, oh, you homophobic. You feel what I'm saying? But at the end of the day, uh, T.S., nobody asked you. Look at T.S. Look at T.S. And listen, this is what T.S. does. This is what T.S. does. T.S. goes fishing for a problem. But I keep telling y'all, all the things T.S. could be doing, T.S. is around here fucking with these people. And then when the people turn back and, and drag T.S. by the balls, now it's old. Homophobic. Homophobic. Look at T.S. Madison laughing in the in the chat. Look. And on, on schoolyard, if just get up in the morning and choose violence or go live on her Instagram right now and drag T.S., T.S. is going to sit up there and be like, there she go. I didn't say nothing to her. I didn't say, yes, you did, bitch. Ain't nobody asked you to put a laughing emoji in, in, in here. It's ridiculous at this point. Somebody had got her ass together to look at all of the black the black male worshippers. Love you, T.S. Oh, T.S., we love you. You love us. You take care of us. You help up for us, T.S. You love you actually love black women. Oh, I love you, T.S. T.S. <laughs> all the BMWs, bitch. Get your ugly ass off of here, girl. What is you talking about? T.S. don't give a mother pluck about you. I can't really see it. But they was dragging her in the comments. Look at somebody say, T.S. T. S. Madison, what's so funny, sir? Do the T stand for Tyrone, Terrence, et cetera? Now, don't come over here fucking with me. I'm just telling y'all what they say. Don't bring your ass over here with that ugly ass shit. Replay gang, I'm telling you now, today my birthday. If I get off of here and y'all in my comments with that ugly ass shit, I'm going to drag you. Do you hear me? I'm just telling you what they say. Okay. Don't come in my comments with that ugly ass shit. Somebody else said you literally need to re relax. Your beef is so one sided, Miss Ma'am. Somebody else said, and this is why people say you're messy and start stuff. Look at this BMW. At TS Madison. But they get mad when you ate her up with her with fun shade. I can't stand that ish. Jess knows exactly what she be doing, but they blamed you. Like you were the problem because you're trans and I don't like the phony whole troll game. They play with it when it comes to you, sister. Stay on their next Maddie. See you at the Myrtle. See you in Myrtle at the residence. So people just running behind TS because TS trans or is TS over here minding bitch business? Women's business. Nobody sends a bad signal for the TS. TS emerges from the smoke. You know what? I, I can't no more. You know, I can't. TS, TS makes her own. Mm -mm, mm -mm, mm -mm. Nope. TS literally creates her own drama. Literally. Literally. This is what it's giving for me. Whenever I see a BMW in the comments, you know how they be doing. Whenever I see the BMWs in the comments doing what they do, this is what I be thinking about in my head. You know what I'm saying? Y'all probably know where I'm going with it, but if you don't, let's just go get it. Whenever I see a BMW in the comments, this is what I be feeling like. Hold on. Oh, Let's get him over here. This is what I be feeling Deserve like. A round of applause. Mm -hmm. 
Let's give Jesus a round of applause. Let's give Jesus a round of applause. Now let's give Jesus a round of applause. Why they take pictures and they want to be on social media. Take the pictures. Take the pictures. Take the pictures. Yep. Take the pictures. And see when the BMW walk by, this how I be feeling. Take the pictures. <laughs> Do you hear me? See when I see a BMW scroll by the comment section like this? This is how I be in my mind. This is how I be. When a BMW be, when I be scrolling through the comments and I see a BMW pull up through the comments, uh, scrolling through that bitch, this is how, this how I be in my head. Look. Take the pictures. Look. Take the pictures. Mm -hmm. Take the pictures. Look, this is the Take BMW. The That's the BMW. Pictures. Yep. Yep. That's how I be feeling. You know what I'm saying? Like, again, at first I dragged the bishop, bishop. Somewhat pseudo apologies, not all, but pseudo apologies, you know what I'm saying? Because Bishop, you know, I didn't understand the vigor behind, you know, when you bit your lip and like, now I get it, Bishop. I I get it. I get it now. Because every time a BMW is a black male worshiper. Shout out to Cynthia uh, G. I didn't make it up. She did. But every time, thank y'all for the happy birthday wishes. Every time I see one of them BMWs through the comments, I swear to God, I'd be like this. Take the pictures. Mm -hmm. Take the pictures. Take the pictures. Take the pictures. There they go. Take this be me. I'm the bishop. Girl, I swear to God. I swear to God, y'all. I swear to God. I swear to God, that's how I be feeling. You know what I mean? I might have anger problems. I might, I might need to go see somebody. You know what I'm saying? I might, I mean, I might need to go talk to somebody. Because that's how I be feeling whenever I see them hoes, you know? But nevertheless, um, where were we? Hold on. Let's get back to over here. T.S., nobody asked you, bitch. Not one person, one soul say, go get the T and the S. Not one. Now, if Masika and had an issue with you and she got on here and dragged you by the bike, then you're going to want to get on here and say it's, it's, it's homophobic. You came over here messing with these people. And I hope Jess get up in the morning, even though I don't like you, Jess, you deserved it. Yes, Jess, you deserved every single thing that happened of uh, that Masika said. Let, let's, let's get a little, t a little piece of what she said again. Aren't you allegedly pregnant by a fucking Puerto Rican nigga that's prettier than you, bitch? Get the f don't nobody know what the fuck, who the fuck he is or what the fuck he does? Is he a professional boyfriend? Don't fucking play with me. Don't fucking play with me because I've always been nice to you. Mm -hmm. Well, and Masika said what she had to say. What's up? But Jess, if you get up in the morning and choose violence, I will be here for the replay game so I can come over here and drag the T and the S. Okay. Now, let's get into TikTok band, girl. Then after this, we're going to get off here and we're going to go to the after party. You guys, if you aren't familiar with where we're going to be for the after party, you see that link pinned to the top of the chat? That's a link to Rumble. We're going to be over there, you know what I'm saying, having a gay old time. No pun intended, no TS. What I'm saying is we're going to be over there having a good time. So y'all make sure y'all go follow me over on Rumble, and we're going to be having a good time. We're going to be talking about some other stuff. We're going to let people up. We're going to do a good, uh, uh, we're going to have a good time. So let's get into it. Um... Uh, uh, TikTok. Okay, TikTok, TikTok, TikTok. So the U.S. House and the Senate and everybody else who post to then pass the bill. TikTok is going away. Yes, it is. Whoa, yes, it is. TikTok is going away. Mm -hmm. If you own TikTok and that's your main source of income, I feel sorry for your fat. Let me tell you why. See, when YouTube uh, 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 laid me off, meaning demonetized me, it was at that part 
I said, never again, devil, never again. So you know what I did? I started saying, I am going to stream from multiple platforms. As of right now, I'm streaming from Rumble, Twitch, not Instagram. I forgot to hook that up. Uh, Facebook and YouTube. Girl, I'm not going to let them play in my face no more like this. Do you understand what I'm trying to say? So the people that went down there and banned TikTok. Nigga said, first to make rib, now TikTok. You know, I've always been skeptical about them ribs, queen. I ain't, them, them ribs ain't had no bone in them. You know what I'm saying? The ribs ain't had no bone. So it just always made me a little skeptical, you know. So maybe the rib, the McRib needed to go. So they banned in TikTok in the U.S. Let's go see what the people had to say. Rumble is an app like any other app. Like, um, like, um, I guess it would be like YouTube. It's a streaming app. All right, so TikTok said, it's, the U.S. say no, ma'am. Breaking, U.S. passes bill that would force TikTok to cut ties with its Chinese owners or be banned in the United States. So they want TikTok to uh, not be uh, dealing with the Chinese people. They say, oh, you're going to get banned. Hell no, ain't nothing at, at McDonald's real meat. I keep telling y'all. I keep telling y'all ain't nothing at, at McDonald's real meat. Y'all don't be wanting to listen. Is the snaggle too banned in lives? Oh, she sure is. Stand by, TikTok. Stand by, TikTok. Let's go see what the snaggle too banned in had to say. You ain't nobody. You ain't scared me. Fuck. I said what I said. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You playing. So he called me, asked about the phone bill. Bitch, I paid the phone bill. Since he's been in locked up, I've been ma managing the phone bill. Why? Because I'm on the account. It's just me and him. She turned them crime them comments off, though. So mm -hmm. he like asked the weird questions. And I was like, I don't trust you niggas. It was parts I didn't record. Like, I don't trust the niggas, bro. Like, what are you calling me for? Why is y'all playing op games, being disrespectful, mean and shit? Like, Hmm. There's this blue bit of the whole. Everybody's been acting weird. Like, why are you putting blue business out there? It's nobody business that he's in the fucking hole. And no, he's not in no hole for no, no dumb shit with no other body. Like, all those rumors, like, y'all not quick to shut down the rumors, but y'all quick to ride the little what's going on. Like, since he's been in the hole, y'all just been fucking weird and shit. Like, whack was what way aggressive when I first came up in this bitch. He, he tried barging and yeah, like, Girl. Press it up and get all type of shit. Like, we not gonna do this all night. This not the first time these niggas be acting weird with me, bro. Like, I'm just a fucking female in this city. Y'all fit is fucking scary, bro. Like, who y'all talking to? <sighs> she has the cost of living, allegedly. Like, I got people that love me. I got family. I got well, where people, they at? Like, who the fuck? And then my son, like, what? What is y'all doing? She got 90 more seconds before I get the fuck off of here. That's why I just see blue to just come home because, like, all these other niggas is in my face. Girl, what's she saying? They can, they can talk to me anytime. We can't hear you, Snaggle, too. Snaggle. Talk into the phone, Snaggle. The fuck? Snaggle, you got to put your face to the phone, Snaggle. Better than they just pulled up when that happened, too. Like, any other time they pull up and try to press the bitch out. Oh my gosh. Out the city, nobody pulled up, check, checked around. She's talking to an imaginary I friend? I think so, too. That was up, it was like Kevin out shit and was blue 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 father and his and his girl like we was in this bitch trying to like stick together because like what the fuck we know what happened it, what the fuck that shit is not so safe we live in a gated community and niggas can still run up like that shit is good. Y'all play these internet games. Stop playing these internet games. Like, I'm not fucking with it at all. Like, 
All right, girl. For real. Shut up. Let's go back to the TikTok band. Girl, I, she, 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 she can't. I don't even know if she's coherent at this point. At the end of the day, hashtag save Junior. I think she's not enough. Oh, yeah, that bitch not enough. You heard Junior? You know her birthday tomorrow. Look, the bitch not enough. I'm gonna start a video with my family and my brothers and shit. You can hear? Hey, but everybody getting on my ass. I'm about to get a fight and get the box. For real. Junior. Huh, Junior. Like, I'm not fucking with it. Like, he la be do be da malu manadi. How's he fucking old to be fucking with me, bro? Bitch, there's somebody in our own size, bro. Junior, huh, Junior? He la be do be da malu manadi. Y'all just got me worried. Y'all got my family worried. All that. They like, what's going on? I really don't know. I can't really tell you. All I know is some grimy niggas. They mean the shit to me. Oh, girl. That's the one thing. They go against it. Like, I don't know if it's them. We'll come back and talk about it tomorrow. Somebody. Shut up. Shut it up. That whole house is the cost of living. Listen to me. We'll talk about it tomorrow. Somebody will screen record it, and we'll go from there. I'm not doing this today with uh, Krishan. Not on my birthday. We'll come back on her birthday and do it. Not on mine. Okay? Not on mine. We're not doing that. Now, what is this? Pay the fucking bill. Hold on. Somebody getting into it with a girl. Stop asking stupid questions and answer the question. Trying to keep your fucking phone on. You asking me why. Who that is? Did you get a text for your phone bill? Yes or no? No, it's just why work, why work speaking against me if I'm saying it happened. Look, you're not listening. Shut up and listen. He's trying to throw a 42 fake to make you think like motherfuckers like that really didn't happen, so motherfuckers don't go over there. But instead, you going on there putting him on blast and making it because niggas came to a crib with a gun, bro. Rock. And for him to say he got footage and it never happened, he whack as fuck. He's saying that so motherfuckers don't come up over there. No, he making it seem like I'm lying about people coming to the hey, house. About hey, it rather, hey, rather make you look like a liar than people to come over there and rob you, right? Which one's better to be? Look like a liar or have a motherfucker over there trying no, to. No, it's. Hey. Did you get a chance for your phone bill right now? Why? What is this? Why do you always fucking act why? If I'm asking you so I can pay the fucking bill, stop acting. Stupid questions and answer the question. I don't know who she's talking to. She ain't put no caption Trying to keep your fucking phone on. You asking me why? Did you get a text for your phone bill? Yes or no? And she turned the camera. Why? 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 Speaking against me if I'm saying it happened. Look, you're not listening. Shut up and listen. He's trying to throw a forty-two fake. To make you think like motherfuckers like that really didn't happen, so motherfuckers don't go over there. I'm confused. But instead, you go. What is going on? She turned the comments off, so you can't even see nobody saying what the fuck going on. Uh, yeah, she turned the comments off. Did you get a text for your phone? Girl, not today, Satan. We'll come back tomorrow for your birthday, bitch. That's not blue face. I don't think it's Petey because I don't think Petey got money to pay her phone bill. That's not blue for a fact. That's not blue. I don't know who this is. I thought it was uh, Blue Brother Dre at first. That's what I thought, Lamisha. I thought it was Dre. Child, we'll deal with it tomorrow, girl. Anyways, back to where we was, because I need to get off here and prepare for my other stream, for my uh, after party. So, 
TikTok is a band. Let's go get it. Let's see all the people are going crazy. Let's see what this clear man has to say. I feel like he know what he's talking about. The House of Representatives has voted to ban TikTok. And here's why the ban is eerily similar to the Patriot Act, which was passed only one month after the event in 2001. The legislation enhanced the government's ability to spy, access emails, and track financial records. But the most nefarious thing it did was expand the definition of domestic terrorism. And they sold it by telling you it was for these guys. But it was later used to justify going after Americans. And now they want you to believe the TikTok ban is about China. But what does the legislation really say? I'll wait a second so you could read what this legend had to say. Because if you look at the definition, it's not just about apps. It includes websites and those who distribute, maintain, and update those apps and websites. I wonder what company that might give them leverage over, or if that would give them leverage over other companies. And what will that do to VPNs and your ability to remain anonymous on the internet? And this is why I write books on how information is controlled, because I think we all know that that is what this is really about. Check out my books on the history of fake news, rights fundamental to being an American, the First Amendment, corruption in banking, and so much more. Lesslearner.com. Get off of here, sir. So long story short, this is what I'm gathering from this whole TikTok ban thing. TikTok is, um, who this is? This the, uh... The U.S. uses about the disappointing vote in the House of Representatives. There has been a lot of misinformation, and I hope to clarify some things. Mm. First, thank you to our incredible community. You are what makes TikTok so special. Thank you for making your voices heard. Over the last few years, we have invested to keep your data safe and our platform free from outside manipulation. We have committed that we will continue to do so. This legislation if signed into law, will lead to a ban of TikTok in the United States. Even the bill sponsors admit that that's their goal. This bill gives more power to a handful of other social media companies. It will also take billions of dollars out of the pockets of creators and small businesses. It will put more than 300,000 American jobs at risk, and it will take away your TikTok. We know how important TikTok is to all of you. It has given our 170 million users a platform to freely express themselves and has empowered more than 7 million businesses in the United States. Our platform matters to the small business owners who rely on TikTok to make ends meet, to the teachers who inspire millions of students to learn, and to everyone who discovers and finds joy on TikTok. We will not stop fighting and advocating for you. We will continue to do all we can, including exercising our legal rights to protect this amazing platform that we have built with you. We believe we can overcome this together. I encourage you to keep sharing your stories. Share them with your friends. Share them with your family. Share them with your senators. Protect your constitutional rights. Make your voices heard. Love you all. Girl. Okay. You know what is given to me? These people playing in y'all face. That's what is given. That's what is given. Listen, this is my take on it. America don't like TikTok because TikTok is able to access shit that America don't want them to access. America want to be the only people to take advantage of your bullshit. Okay? They don't want nobody else to take advantage. Just them. And then TikTok is over here playing in y'all face. Because TikTok is over there saying, oh, we've, uh, we've empowered all these businesses. And you made a whole generation or two of people slow as a fucking turtle. Do you hear me? Slow as a turtle. TikTok is the reason why people be on YouTube saying, voodoo, your videos are so long. I can't sit there all that time. I don't have that type of attention span, voodoo. Because of TikTok. And Instagram, but ultimately right now, TikTok is the brand, the main corporate. Also, this man over here saying all that yin, 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 and all I'm getting is this. Jackie Chan revealed an intriguing anecdote about this. Jackie Chan, uh, 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 Chris Tucker, okay? It, it's given, you know, um, What? I don't understand. 
Now, now one of these people, the U.S. nor the TikTok people have your best interest at heart. All of them are taking advantage of you. So rather TikTok comes or goes, I don't care. Because either way, if TikTok don't, don't bend me over, all these other platforms damn sure will. You feel me? So in my opinion, in my opinion, it don't matter who bends me over as long as I get some $40 or something on the dresser, okay? Just leave me something on the dresser at this point. I mean, what you want me to do? Oh my God, TikTok is going to go. What are we going to do? Just go to another platform. Duh. I'm not going to miss it. But again, I, I'm being, I'm coming from a, bi a biased place because I don't be on TikTok. So, you know, but hell, even if YouTube dip, what's, what's the next popular platform? What's up? You feel what I'm saying? Girl, all them people playing in y'all face. Anywho's, thank you, Black71, for the cash app. I'm getting some cash apps out the way. Thank you, BX Mel, for the cash app. Happy birthday, Vu. Thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you, Doreen, for the cash. A wonderful cash app. Happy birthday, my sister. Thank you so much, Doreen. Thank you, Deb, uh, Deb S. U. Lee. Uh, Deb Suli, I think that's how you say it. And for the wonderful cash app, thank you so much. I appreciate y'all. Thank you, T Camp, for the cash app. Happy birthday. Thank you, thank you, thank you. You guys, if you want to support me, literally all you have to do is like the video. I mean, cash is always accepted. <laughs> you know what I mean? But if you like the video, that will be just the same. You guys, also, hold on, somebody else. Sharila Sh Shari Outlaw, thank you so much for the cash app. She said happy birthday, Fat. Oh, thank you. <laughs> Y'all about to make me make the Krishan face. DJ Vic the Brick vibing with Vic. Thank y'all. Thank you so much. Happy birthday, Boo. Thank you for all you do. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Miss Bennett to you. Thank you. Y'all are showing the dolls some love. Do you hear me? Thank you, JMW Marward. Mar Thank you so much. Happy birthday. Enjoy. I appreciate you. Like I said, you guys, if you want to support the channel, please just like the big the video. That would be wonderful. Keisha Bankhead. Thank you so much. Liking the video is, is wonderful. That pushes us in the algorithm and it gets people to know to come over here. We'd be around here jostling and acting a fool. Thank you, Reese, for the cash app. Oh shit. I clicked off it too fast. Where'd it go? It says, I'm Black Rosen Me Garden on YouTube. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Let me see if I'm missing anybody else. Yeah, I got so many that came through, y'all. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Rochelle, thank you. Happy birthday. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Um Pretty J, pretty J amazing. Thank you so much. Happy birthday, eight for infinity of blessings. Oh, thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Shout out to everybody who's sending me a cash up. It's so many. I'm not even gonna lie. I'm super overwhelmed. I didn't think that you know it would be like this, but ultimately it is. And I'm super duper appreciative. Like words can't express how appreciative I am. Thank you, Laura, Amber, Katina. Thank you, uh, Anita, Sonji, Lakeisha. Thank you. Gaden L. Thank you so much. Happy birthday. Uh, I appreciate what you do for the generous, wonder wonderful cash app. You didn't have to do that. You guys, uh, everybody who sent me a cash app, I'm greatly appreciative. If I missed anybody, I'm so sorry. Um, April, Nicole, Trudy, Quila, Whitney, Megan, Angela, Vanessa, Sheila, Radiant, uh, Makila, Jocelyn. I think I, I, I thank y'all already earlier. My aunt, thank you, my gosh. Thank you, my God. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Happy solar return to my fellow Pisces. Three, five. My aunt, your birthday was on the fifth? Oh, thank you. Happy birthday to you as well. Thank you, Colette Fisher, for the cash app. I appreciate y'all. Y'all really showing the doll love. You guys, do me a favor. Like the video if you haven't already. Uh, also, we're going to go over uh, Rumble at 8.15. 8.15 will be over at Rumble. I just need to get myself situated, y'all. I have to get myself situated before we go to Rumble. Um, but 
if you are familiar with where Rumble is, um, let me see. Let me post it in. It's in the YouTube chat. If you're on Facebook, well, if you're already on Rumble, you know where we, you know where we at. If you're on Twitch, can one of the mods repost it in the? Um, oh, there you go, daughter of the Most High already did it. Daughter of the Most High already did it. You guys, I need to get y'all to follow me on these other platforms, Twitch and Rumble. I appreciate y'all. I appreciate y'all. I appreciate y'all. Y'all meet me over there about 8.30. Thank you so much for the support. This is my day. <laughs> Happy birthday to me. Okay. And um, here comes Saint. Girl, bye. Anyways, I love you guys. And I'll see y'all tomorrow. We're going to drag Krishan tomorrow on her birthday. You get it. Pull up for the morning jokes tomorrow as well. You know, we jokes in the morning uh, and have a gay old time. No pun intended. Also, pull up to all these other platforms. I appreciate all the love and support. I'm so appreciative and so humbled. Thank y'all so much for everything you do. I've been busting my ass, y'all. I'm tired. I ain't gonna lie. I'm tired. But I love y'all. I love y'all. I love y'all. And I do it for y'all. Thank y'all so much. Y'all know how we roll around here. We jokes in and we jokes out. I love you. See y'all later. And I'll see y'all down there at the after party. Pin to the top of the chat. Bye, y'all. Mic check, one, two, one, two. We live, baby. Come, come on. <laughs> That's right. Okay. Can you, can, you, can you hear me now? Oh, let's go. It's your boy, Big Chew, the voice of the beat. You know what I want. Blaze up. Come on, Blaze up. It's a beat for me. Wah, 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 w